Hi everyone, welcome to this little vlog. In today's video, we are going to be going to the REM Beauty Sweetener Shop pop-up in New York. Um, I forgot to record an intro, so here it is. Enjoy the video. Hello, I forgot to literally record everything, so that's okay now. We're, we're about to, we're at Penn Station at Long Island things. Ah, the subway! I'd rather eat the subway. Do you guys ever get scared on the subway? No, the lighting sucks. I look ugly. I don't, I don't want to look ugly. Let's see if that's better. Oh, yeah, that's kind of better. We're in Soho. We're just walking. It's like a five minute walk. Um, backstory. I basically had a full mental breakdown when I found out that Ariana was at the store on the first day. Um, <laughs> that was genuinely like, like genuinely, like I am not even happy for the people who met her. Like that literally should have been me. It literally should have been me. Um, I, I wish I could say I was kidding, but I'm, <laughs> but I'm not. Like I'm just not, like I'm literally bitter. I dressed like SpongeBob to try and attract her. Cause clearly that's what she's into. Love you, Ariana. In all seriousness, I'm really excited. Um, just walking, vibing. Yeah, probably gonna do a bunch of other stuff today, so I'll just vlog everything. Cause I don't really think that this like ice cream shop is like big. I think it's just like to sell her foundation. But we get free ice cream and there's merch. And if I can get merch, then I'll be happy. So. I hope this is fun. I hope this is enjoyable. Let's do it. I will say we picked the best day to come here. It's like literally so nice out. It is so nice out. Oh my God. <laughs> We're here. The line is very long. Very, very long. It's about the equivalent of two blocks. So that's fab. Um, it's two o'clock now. We got here around one o'clock. So we'll see how long. Hold on. <laughs> done at the pop-up it was very cute they, we asked and they cut off the line at literally 3 p.m i'm like like imagine it's like open till 7 and like the line gets cut off at 3 that's actually busy yeah it was it was really busy it was a really long line and they said thursday was their busiest day which is today i i don't know it was worth it but it was fun it was cute but on to different things i am already home I, I thought I would have more footage to record, but guess how long the REM beauty line took? Four hours. Four hours. Just sitting online. <laughs> I'm just going to apologize now for the amount of times that I bring up I waited four hours in line. I literally bring it up a million times in the next seven minutes. 
So yeah, needless to say, after waiting four hours, not that we were like completely drained, but we were definitely getting there. Luckily, it was a really nice day out, so it wasn't like we were like sweating or anything, but we were pretty tired, so we didn't really wind up doing anything else, hence why I thought I'd have more footage, but don't. So we got there around one, and and I'll, I'll kind of show a little map of the line, but it like basically was the equivalent of two blocks. So it started at the end of one block, got to the corner of the street, and then was all the way at the end of that block. You'll, you'll see it on the screen. So I knew it was long when we got on it, but I was like, you know what, like, fun merch, free ice cream, Ariana, whatever. I was excited, I was down. I did not think it would take four hours, very earnestly. We did not get inside until 4.45, so it was like three hours and 45 minutes, but for all intents, four hours. Listen, I know Ariana is so famous, and like, I, I feel like really what what prompted people to show up at that many people to show up is the fact that she showed up the first day and like actually was there but i i, I don't know why I, I just feel like in my head that like no one not not no one but like a lot of people don't really care about her makeup brand like it's not like it's like ridiculously popular like rare beauty or venti beauty or something so i was just like you know like i didn't think that many people were gonna go but i was wrong and I was online for four hours, but fine. Four hours, whatever. Um, it gets worse, though, because I was willing to wait four hours knowing, like, everything that was inside because, you know, there was merch, there were sweaters, there was t-shirts, all that stuff. Well, sorta, kinda. Well, sorta, kinda. Not really, because we got inside and basically, well, well midway through the line, we found out that the sweatshirts were fold out sold out, which was a bummer, because that was the one, you know, we, we saw Ariana wore when she went, so I, that's probably why it sold out, but I was like, you know what, whatever, like, it's not a big deal, I'll just get a t-shirt or something. As we're about to walk inside, sweaters and t-shirts were both sold out. Okay, 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 you know, whatever, fine, I guess. She had an ice cream flavor called, like, sweetener something, I don't know, sold out. Okay. What else? Oh yeah, and the photo booth was not working. I, I'd hate to be like nitpicky, cause like don't get me wrong, it was fun, but like to have waited four hours, which like I get it, it was my choice and it was free, so like I, I didn't have to wait four hours, but to not have everything working, like and not have everything there, like that's a little annoying. I got a couple of things. <laughs> I did get the tote bag, this was still available, not a lot left, and it's cute, don't get me wrong, it was $20, which, like, I don't want to say that's cheap, but, like, you know, expected, and it's pretty big, and, I don't know, I'm excited. I got a couple, I'm hoping to re resell, resell one, don't judge me. Um, don't look at me like that. What else did I get? Yeah, I got, like, this is just, like, I don't know, like, a coaster, but, like, it, it wasn't even for sale, it's just kind of what they use to, like, shade match you. <laughs> There are no words. There genuinely are no words. I genuinely bought an R.E.M. Beauty ice cream scooper. For $20. <laughs> Just mind you, imagine waiting four hours on a line and like, you get inside and like, half the stuff isn't there. You're gonna buy an ice cream scooper, okay? That's, that, that's where we were at. Yeah it, yeah, it was to the point where we were just grabbing the napkins. Literally any souvenir we can find, we were taking it because we waited four hours. Best believe I was getting my free napkins. And this sticker, you know, cute, all that. But yeah, like, after I got my free ice cream and bought my merch, like, that was it. Like, that was, that was literally it. Like, I had been in there for a total of two minutes after waiting four hours, so I was like, okay, like, I don't even really want... Well, I don't really need the foundation, but basically they had the deal where you buy the foundation, you get a brush, so I'm just like, I waited four hours, like, let me at least get my damn shade matched by the foundation. So I did. I got the free brush, Wh which is weird. They had the brushes in this... I don't know if this is the packaging she's sending it in, but it's literally paper, and I'm like... I'm a big packaging gal, so paper packaging is strange. I don't know if that's for just how the brushes come, or if that was specifically for this. But as for the foundation, um, let me, just one second. 
awesome. Oh, oh yeah, it's not in the bag. You want to know why? Because they didn't have them there. They just shipped them to your house. Why well, have a pop-up to, to launch your new foundation if you're not even going to have the foundation there? I don't get that. Why? So, like, it's it's really not that big a deal. It's not like I needed the foundation, but, like, I, I feel like it, it was kind of for the foundation. So why not just have it? That really did not make any sense to me. But the brush is cute. I'm excited to use it with the foundation that I don't have. <laughs> I'm so mad. No, like, don't get me wrong. Like, I'm glad I won. Like, it was, like, you know, a three-day thing, and I'm, I'm very grateful that I got to go and that it was near me, but... I, uh, but I do think I reserve the right to be a little bitter after waiting four hours in line and not really getting all that was promised. Four hours. Four hours. Four hours. Four hours. Four hours. Four hours. For four hours. Four hours. Four hours. Four hours. No. Four hours. I think what made me the most mad and was the icing on top because like it was like you know after I had gotten the building because like even before I got in like I mean to be fair it was right before I got in I found out like some a lot of the merch was sold out like I was like whatever it's fine but like then to ha not have the ice cream and the the Polaroid machine working like I was like okay well like that that I'm gonna have to I I'm definitely critiquing for because like girl this is like a three-day thing like like it's not like they had to keep this machine running for like a year like I get it like maintenance whatever but like it was three days like how hard is it to keep a Polaroid machine running for three days I got a camera that can do that um but that's everything <laughs> thank you for watching I'm sorry for being so bitter um see you in the next video bye